So for this problem, to find the derivative of inverse trigonometric functions, then for this given, the derivative of inverse sine using this formula, so we have u equals the square root of 1 minus x squared. Then to find the derivative of u, so using this formula that the square root of u to find the derivative, so we have the derivative of u over just add 2 to the given. So for this square root of 1 minus x squared, since the derivative of 1 minus x squared is negative 2x, then over just add 2, then copy the square root of 1 minus x squared. Then we can cancel this 2, so du equals negative x, then over the square root of 1 minus x squared. So this is now du. Then to find now the derivative from this formula, so we have 1, then over the square root of 1 minus u squared and u is the square root of 1 minus x to the power 2, quantity to the power 2, then times du, the derivative of u, that's negative x, then over the square root of 1 minus x squared, then to simplify, so we have y prime equals 1, then the square root of 1, then minus. So we can cancel now this radical. So this becomes 1 minus x squared in times negative x, then over the square root of 1 minus x squared. Then we have y prime equals 1 then over so the square root of 1 distribute now this negative so this becomes negative 1 and this becomes positive x squared in times the negative x then over the square root of 1 minus x squared then we have y prime equals 1, then over this positive 1, negative 1, this 1 is 0. So we have the square root of x squared times negative x, then over the square root of 1 minus x squared. So we have y prime equals 1 over, so we can cancel now this radical, so over x. 10 times negative x over the square root of 1 minus x squared. Then this time we can cancel now this x. So y prime equals negative 1 then over the square root of 1 minus x squared. Then for this given, so for the inverse cosine, so we have u is x over 1 minus x. Then to find the derivative, so using the quotient rule, so this is v times the derivative of u, then minus u times the derivative of v over v squared. So this is u over v. So by this formula, so we have v. v is 1 minus x times the derivative of u. So the derivative of x, that's 1. Then minus u times the derivative of v. The derivative of 1 minus x, this is negative 1. Then over v to the power 2, 
then to simplify so this is 1 minus x this becomes positive x then over 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 so therefore du or the derivative of u this one is 0 so we have 1 then over 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 so to find now the derivative so y prime equals so from this formula so this is negative 1 then over the square root of 1 minus u to the power 2 and u is x over 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 then times the derivative of u that's 1 then over the quantity of 1 minus x to the power 2 then to simplify, so we have y prime equals negative 1, then over the square root of 1 minus, distribute this exponent, this becomes x squared over, distribute this exponent, so 1 minus x to the power 2, then times 1, then over, 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 then to simplify so we have negative 1 then for this denominator so we can use the butterfly method so multiply so we have 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 minus x squared in over 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 then times 1 then over 1 minus x quantity to the power 2 then we have y prime equals negative 1 then over the square root so we can expand this 1 minus x to the power 2 so this is equal to 1 minus 2x plus x squared then bring down negative x squared then over because we can take the square root of 1 minus x to the power 2 so just cancel this squared so outside the radical so this becomes 1 minus x then times 1 over the quantity of 1 minus x to the power 2. Then we have y prime equals negative 1. So this time we can take now the reciprocal of this denominator. So we have times the reciprocal is 1 minus x then over the square root since we can combine this x squared positive and negative this one is zero so the remaining is one minus two x then times one then over the quantity of one minus x to the power two then observe that we can cancel this 1 minus x and 1 minus x then multiply so we have negative 1 then over 1 minus x times the square root of 1 minus 2x then for this even so u is 4 over x then du so using the quotient rules this is v times the derivative of u minus u times the derivative of v over v squared so v is x times the derivative of u so the derivative of a constant is 0 
natin minus u is 4 times the derivative of x, that's 1, then over b squared or x squared. So we have now du equals, this one is 0. So this is negative 4 over x to the power 2. So to find now the derivative, so for inverse tangent, so this is 1 then over 1 plus u to the power 2 and u is 4 over x then quantity to the power 2 times du and du is negative 4 over x to the power 2. Then to simplify, so we have y prime equals 1 then over 1 plus 4 to the power 2, that's 16 over this x to the power 2. Then times negative 4 over x to the power 2. Then to simplify, so this is 1 then over, so using the butterfly method, so multiply. This is x squared plus 16 over x squared then times negative 4 over x squared. Then we have y prime equals 1 then times the reciprocal of this denominator. So this becomes x squared then over x squared plus 16 then times this negative 4 over x squared then we can cancel now this x squared and multiply so y prime equals negative 4 over x squared plus 16